What is falling rate drying? It's a stage during drying of a wetted material when critical moisture content has been reached. Critical moisture content is the insufficient water content in the solid to maintain a constant water film on the surface. The drying is then followed by the evaporation of water from the surface of the solid and also from within the pores of solid until equilibrium moisture content has been reached. Drying curve at constant drying conditions. Note that during the falling rate period, drying rate drops instead of staying constant as in the constant rate period. The falling rate period can be divided into two phases. The first phase starts when the solid has reached critical moisture content. Water on the surface evaporates until the surface is completely dry. At point D, there starts to be an increased drop in drying rate. During this second phase, moisture diffusion inside the solid becomes rate controlling. Water which is trapped in the internal pores draws heat from material itself and the surrounding air. This latent heat of vaporization vaporizes the water, which then diffuses through the pore towards the surface of the solid, eventually diffusing into the bulk drying air. This evaporation continues until the water content of the solid is in equilibrium with the surrounding drying air, termed as equilibrium moisture content. Drying rate is now zero.